Hello everybody, so today I will talk about calculus. The topic today is about differential equations. So now I will show you how to answer. We know that this one equals to number 0, so we just find only complementary solutions. So I will put about yc. equals to e to the power of lambda s. If we do first the derivative of this one, we have lambda e to the power of lambda s. Because first the derivative of this one, we keep about this one in here. Later that we do first the derivative of lambda s, you got about lambda. Next we do second the derivative, and we have lambda square e to the power of lambda s. Now we have this one in here. So I will put this one go in here, this one go in here, and this one go in here. So we will have about lambda square e to the power of lambda s, and the next one we have lambda e to the power of lambda s. And this one we have negative number 2 e to the power of lambda s equals to number 0. Now we can do about factorization by this one. Now we need, need to find the solutions of this one. This one we have two solutions. That's about lambda equal to number one and lambda equal to negative number two. And now we have the final answer. So we have C number one. That's about the constant number one multiplied by e to the power of lambda s. Lambda we change by number one. So we have s in here. Now we have C number 2, e to the power of negative number 2, s. We change lambda into negative number 2. And now we have the conditions. So for the first one, if we put number 0 cone here, number 0 cone here, we have C1 and C2. Because this one you got about 1 and 1. So we have first equation. So we have C1 plus C2. And this one equals to number 3. Now we need to find first the derivative of y. So first the derivative of e to the power of s, we keep the same. First the derivative of this one, we have negative number 2 c number 2 e to the power of negative number 2 and later that we put number 0 cone here and here so this one you got about 1 and 1 so we have c1 minus number 2 c2 and this one you got about 0 and now we need to find the solution of c1 c2 in the system of equations and we have C number 1 equals to number 2 and C number 2 equals to number 1. After we find C1 and C2, we go back in here and we have choose e to the power of s plus e to the power of negative 2s because this is about 1 so we can simplify like this this is the end thank you for watching